energy depression is a bitch that won't stop texting me hi everybody holy cannoli where have i been <laughs> having a crisis of life i think that that's where i've been um i can't even remember the last time i have been on youtube let's take a look here and see when the last time and i'm very sorry for that um I have a reason, and that's why I'm making this video before I continue with, you know, two months. It's been two months. I don't even have a sense of time right now, and it's starting to come back to me because I've made a lot of different life choices um, health-wise because I have recently, in these two months, been diagnosed one after the other with multiple autoimmune disorders. Um, and it's, it's getting a little much. I'm in so much pain. I have fibro, fibromalacia, or however you say it. Um, rheumatoid, rheumatoid arthritis, um, psoriasis, Eller downloads, Eller, Eller's downloads. I still can't get that one. I have a speech impediment. Um, my hips and my joints and everything are popping in and out of the socket. So, so much for being you know, um, double jointed and how cool it was that I had the number one record in my town for the sit and reach, you know, during school and I did all these sports because now having this autoimmune disorder, I'm screwed. <laughs> and on top of it, you know, day to day stuff. And then I got down a very, I don't know, like conspiracy hole, I guess you could say, and I'm still in it wondering exactly what's going on with the world. So I turned more into my herbs, which you guys knew I was into. Um, it turned more from a crystal kind of pagan thing to more of herbology. And I've been making tinctures and selves and, you know, smoke, um, like smoke kits with herbs that you can smoke for different reasons and just all sorts of things. I've been working on my garden. I'm, ma I'm making organic food for my home um, and just taking care of my family and taking care of myself. And I have lost a lot of weight. My husband lost a lot of weight because he was recently diagnosed with diabetes too. So he corrected that within two weeks. I was so proud of him. The doctors were insanely proud. Um, but we, I hope I'm not blurry. We have we've been trying to just go through really big life changes like the rest of us, you know? The government's telling us that there's aliens, um, whatever. Take me with you, please. Like, take me or just, I don't care, you know? Because the government's trying to kill us. That's a bigger threat than aliens right now. So, there's just so much going on, and to sit down and talk about makeup was pretty hard. I went through highs and lows and highs and lows, um, being stuck to where I couldn't even shower, I couldn't function. I'm still trying to get back the cleaning aspect of it. My home is the dirtiest it's ever been. That bugs me out. Um, I don't like that, so I've been working on that. And then my husband also had a mental breakdown, and I had to help him through that and be supportive as well as my own. <laughs> so... You know, I could keep going, but I just wanted to let you guys know roughly what's been going on. Um, I, I've changed a lot. I started taking doses of Shilajet, um, which you can look up online. It looks like black tar heroin, to be honest, it, but it's not like a ball. It's just tar. It, it tastes great. It's fine. Um, but it's got over 85 minerals and um, different kinds of fulvic acids and stuff like that in it. It's supposed to be amazing for you. I've been using pure magnesium on my feet twice a day. I've been ingesting certain herbs and tinctures and I have gotten my pain to go away completely without the need of medication. I am listening to different frequencies on YouTube. I'm taking um, detox stuff, parasitic detox, because we all have parasites. I didn't realize it, but I guess everybody does. And that is the leading cause of cancer, supposedly. So I've we've just been kind of, I guess you could go, you could say we've been going into our hippie stage, our natural stage. I wear onesies most days and play in my garden. That's where I've been. So when I think of makeup and stuff, it's been a little 
hard to be passionate about it. And then just recently, I started using makeup again because I was like, you know what? I'm tired of looking like a gremlin. Um, and I'm like, this is why I loved it. <laughs> so I am back. Um, I'm going to try my hardest to stay consistent. I don't know how much I'll be doing weekly, but there will be something. Um, and as of content, we're just going to get up and keep on keeping on. We got a lot of stuff to talk about with Shot Miss A. We got a lot of stuff to talk about that I've been loving since we last talked. That is completely different than anything I've talked about. And I'm excited about that. So I'm, I just wanted to get on and say I'm okay. I'm back. I'm here. I'm present. I'm better than ever. Um, I wasn't though for those last two months. I know some people were mad at me that I disappeared and you know, I tried so hard. Um, but I am present now and ready to try again. So anybody that struggles with mental health and especially these days, I know you feel me. So I will be trying my best. I might actually bring back chatty videos because there's so much to talk about these days in the world in general. Um, and some of us just need some freaking girl talk. I need girl talk. Okay. And I let people that I didn't even know take that away from us. And I'm almost 40. <laughs> I'm good with, with that. I'm good with that. I've healed that. I've moved on from that and I'm ready to like bring myself back. So that's what I wanted to say to you guys first and foremost. In the next video you will see is a Shop Miss A haul because I finally made one of those. Um, Shop Miss A has been a little lacking for me but they recently are like picking up again. So um, if you guys have any questions, anything, any kind of comments, leave them in the comment section, of course, and I will reply to you guys. I'm going to get better at that as well. And I, of course, will see you guys in the next one. <laughs>